Four brand new transformations have been revealed for Princess Peach Showtime, along with some new extended gameplay. So let's take a look and break it all down. Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Sarah Sunstone, and today we will be going over Peach's latest transformations for the upcoming title, Princess Peach Showtime. These were recently revealed in the brand new Act 2 trailer, and additional gameplay has been shared on the official Japanese website, so without any further ado, let's get right into it. The first new transformation is Figure Skater Peach. She looks absolutely gorgeous. I am obsessed with this transformation. With this transformation, Princess as Peach is always in motion as she dances and skates around an icy winter wonderland. There appears to be some sort of rhythm mechanic, as we can see here when she's spinning on a path of snowflake lights. Her movement also seems to affect other characters around her, both friend and foe. Finally, we can also see her collecting crystals while dodging obstacles, similar to those we've seen in other stages, so there's a chance that these crystals are found as an element in every single stage. The next new transformation is Dashing Thief Peach, or Phantom Thief Peach, as she is called on the Japanese website. Website. The thief transformation is super cool to me because Peach will have a bunch of different movement mechanics so she can traverse zip lines in a sort of side scrolling environment. She also will have the ability to grapple across obstacles and even paraglide through the air. This is the transformation that I thought was a spy transformation, so we're pretty close. We're pretty close on the mark. It also appears that she will be able to hack certain technology, which is really cool, to help change the environment around her. So in this clip, it looks like she's disabling some laser traps to pass through safely. But you can also see security cameras in some of the clips, so I'm curious to see if we'll be able to hack those as well, or if we'll have to sneak by undetected. It seems like it's gonna be really fun. The third new transformation is Mermaid Peach, which was not on my radar at all, but I'm so happy to see. She looks gorgeous as a mermaid, of course. Peach's voice seems to affect the environment in different ways, so it appears she's controlling schools of fish to trap enemies and even save friends who are stuck in bubbles. It seems like this stage will have a very heavy emphasis placed on music, including different elements in the environment itself, like these musical note-shaped fishies. The final new transformation is Mighty Peach or Superhero Peach. The costume really reminds me of Mega Man, but she looks so cool. This transformation set has a space theme with a focus on tech, and it appears that as Mighty Peach, you will engage with a number of combat-oriented scenarios, from airborne combat to lifting enemies with super strength over her head. So those were the brand new transformations recently revealed for Princess Peach as part of the Act 2 trailer. Interestingly, the thumbnail for this trailer also included Sword Fighter Peach, so it's likely that these five transformations will all be encountered in the second half of the game, while the first half, or Act 1, will likely include Kung Fu Peach, Cowgirl Peach, Ninja Peach, Patissier Peach, and Detective Peach. It's also quite likely that we've now seen all transformations that will be included in the game, just based on there being 10 transformations along with 10 show posters at the front of the Sparkle Theater. But please keep in mind that this is all speculation. So there you have it, friends. Those were the latest reveals for Peach's transformations in the upcoming game, Princess Peach Showtime. Please let me know down in the comments which of her transformations you are most curious about, excited for, anything and everything. You know I always love hearing from you. Please go ahead and shine the lovely like button if you are excited for Princess Peach to be the star of her own game. And with all that being said, thank you so much for watching. I love you all. And until next time, take care. And a very special thanks to Paul, Meredith, Janelle, Teresa, Ember, Formotis, Tansy, Becca, Anime Lover, Jack, Janes, Cisco, Phoebe, Dragonfay, Blossom, It's Me, Andrea, Salvador, Daniel, Dominique, Cricket, Tina, Steffi, Kelly, Cheese, Kayla, Faviola, Kicknell, Alyssa, Floras, Arnica, Grey Ghost, Valley Wolf, Danny, Kelly, Carrie, and Claus, my beautiful gemstone members. I love you all very much and thank you so, so much for the extra support on the channel, which really helps to make everything I do possible and means the world to me.